can't wait. What are they gonna look like? Crud, I wanna know. Ah, this is this is so exciting, crap, man. I'm so invested. This is like I haven't felt this way about a game in a super, super long time. I'm so happy I played this blind. I wonder how Lysithia looks. Hmm. Wait, is Lysithia even alive? Oh my god. No. Okay, each unit has grown over the the past five years. You should check their classes and weapons. Okay. What does that mean? I'm scared. Well, <gasps> that face is certainly <laughs> familiar. I am glad to see you alive and well, Professor. What? Boy, Hubert, what did you... Oh my god, look at them all! Oh my god, Petra, you turn... Oh my god, what did... Look at... What? <laughs> I'm like, God, is this what my class reunion is going to be like? Holy crap, dude. Professor, it's me, Bernie. Uh, Do you remember me? I can't believe you're here. Look at her. She's, she's so sad. Oh my god. I, I'm just, My jaw hit the floor. I can't believe it. Is this a dream? Can we really be this lucky? <laughs> Bro, it's, it's happening. This is not dreaming. Our professor is with us again. Welcome to the back. <laughs> I mean, welcome back. <laughs> Thank you, Petra. Our group isn't the same without what? you. I am overjoyed to see you again. I like that Ferdinand. I didn't realize his hair was that long, but it is. Guy, he's really just like, he's dabbing on his old man, dude. I have all the hair in the world now, father. Relinquish your position. Oh, no, funny, please. It's been so long. Seeing you again fills my heart with hope. Dorothea didn't even change. I mean, other than the hat, I guess. She looks She looks kind of since the same, huh? Great. Now everything will be easy. Um, that's great you're safe, Professor. I'm <laughs> deeply, deeply moved. And it's just like, well, I get, wow. That's great. Crab, I can't Quite believe. the reunion, isn't it, Professor? Yeah. Everyone's happy to see you. I'm happy to see you that. Look, Caspar got tall! He's almost as tall as Hubert now! Holy crap! Come on, Edelgard. You must be happier than all of us combined. <laughs> she took it really hard when you disappeared, Professor. Oh, she's blushing, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> of course, we did our very best in your absence, and there was never a day that we doubted you would return to us. Edelgard has been leading us as Emperor, but after you disappeared, it became apparent that you were her anchor. It gives me regret to be admitting this, but our power is not enough. The only one who can be meeting Edelgard's expectations is you, Professor. Well, what are we waiting for, crud? We gotta start this- we gotta start the campaign eventually, right? The most impressive of all is your uncanny ability to bring a smile to everyone's face. In the years since you vanished, we have not lost anyone from our ranks. Thank God. We all longed for your presence and your leadership. Myself included. It seems fitting to view this as a new beginning for the Black Eagle Strike Force. We already have our target. Oh god, we're getting to work already. Yo, Hubert, real talk? Look at the look at the hair. God, the detail in this game. Okay, the models are great. But look at his artwork. He's even got like I don't know what you'd call it, but they're not horns, but they kind of do look like horns. Hubert, I'm I'm happy you don't look like a villain anymore. Just saying. Yes. We must eliminate the alliance no. before moving on to fight the kingdom and the church. Are you sure about that? However, that doesn't necessarily mean we must occupy the entirety of the Alliance. Okay. that's That at least sounds a little bit better. House Regan stands against the Empire. Therefore, our target is Deirdre, the aquatic capital. We must cross the Aramid River, which separates the Empire and the Alliance. To do that, we must take the largest bridge across it. The Great Bridge of Murden. Murden connects the monastery and the Imperial capital to the east. It is the shortest route there. Well, if, Cla if Claude's against us, I, I guess there isn't any other way around it. An alliance stronghold Oof. has been built at the Great Bridge. We'll take that and then head north. At the same time, we must defeat the one who defends it, Judith von Daphne. Okay. If we can also take control of Daphne territory, it would be greatly beneficial to us. Well, it's time for war. I can't. I can't be. We gotta get this done if we want to defeat Rhea. Prepare yourselves. The next battle will be a momentous one. Join me, my friends, as we begin our journey to bring peace and solace to this war-ravaged world.
Didn't we start the war, though? I mean, for good reason, I suppose. But still, that is... God dang. Yeah. Starting the, starting the new supports already, I see. I, I will get... He is one of my favorite units. But I also want to see... Ah, screw it. We'll do it. I want to. I just want to see if she's okay. What the? <laughs> Take that! God dang, he's been busy, huh? Hey, bud. How can you fight with all that hair? Crying more intensely than usual, I guess. Yes, I am in a hurry. Hey. Huh? Edelgard claims victory after victory. What? She never stops. Ferdy, it's a little. It's a. It's getting kind of old. It's five years ago. Quit with the rivalry. She's literally the emperor. Bruh. Five years ago, she ascended the throne and swept away the corrupt nobles. My father included. I always thought I would be the one to unseat him. Oh. But she did it instead. With all the ease and indifference of someone cracking an egg. I picked up an egg today and cracked it with my hands by accident, so... What are you trying to say? Now, as the head of House Iyer, I serve Edelgard. I have to accept that I am her subordinate, working beneath her to reunify Fodlan. The disparity between Edelgard and myself is obvious. She never stops moving forward, single-minded, never wavering. But where does that leave me? Here, flailing about, going nowhere, contributing nothing. Man, he's really, wow, he's really upset about this. Like, Jesus Christ. I guess it would, <laughs> when he built up his whole life to, you know, not his whole life, but like unseating his dad meant a lot to him. And when Edelgard just comes in and does it instantly, where does that leave Ferdy? Bro, but like, come on, that's, <laughs> you can still contribute. There's still a war to win. You know this. But it is. That is the reality. <sighs> yeah, trying to convince him is not easy. <laughs> not once since our days at the Academy have I exceeded Edelgard's abilities. Well, she's kind of cheating with... Uh, well, I can't mention the crests, but... I saw her as a worthy opponent. She did not even see me as a contender. She did not even consider me at all. As the head of the Noble House Iyer, I must be able to achieve results. Bro, you are, though. But all my efforts have come to nothing. What? <laughs> results are everything. I have not shown results. So I will be stagnating here forever. Man. But you have, bro. Come on. I appreciate your kind words. But you are wrong. Oh, my God. Slap him. He's... <sighs> Maybe that's not the right approach. Okay, it's definitely not the right approach, but God. I know that I have a massive wall to climb, and I must climb it alone. Even so, may I ask a favor? Sure. You want me to swatch you? What, what is it? <laughs> Come on, <laughs> say it. Professor, please keep an eye on my progress. I would appreciate if you were always by my side, bearing witness to my accomplishments. Well, like... You acting like I wasn't already doing that. Crud, man. All the years, the time skip has not been ultra kind to Ferdinand, but it could be worse, I suppose. What do we got? St. Keyhole Day. There will be a hymn in the cathedral. Yeah, let's go for it, I guess. Might as well. Whoa, 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 whoa. Singing with oh. others is a nice change of pace. Oh my god! Usually I do it when I'm alone. Look at her! Lysithia. I'm at a loss of words. Holy crud. She. <laughs> the music here is very fitting. That's all I'll say. Learning these things gives me great difficult. Uh. difficulty. Bro, I love this game. She didn't get any time. Oh, holy frick! This place blew up. What the crud happened? Oh yeah, we we were throwing around giant barrels of TNT and stuff. I kind of forgot that. Oh, the new music is so cool. Oh, so we can win a silver sword plus. Wowie zowie! Let's uh. Okay, I want to check the battle menu first. Okay, so no paralogs, just grinding missions. Okay, that's good. 
how do we explore now? Wait, how do we do seminars? <laughs> we're still, uh, we're still teaching at the monastery. I mean, I guess, but no, I guess, I guess we're still technically the professor. Oh God, look at the sky. This is so cool. Wait, are these? Oh no, these are Empire soldiers now instead of uh, students. Okay. This game is so awesome. What the crud? I was wondering this whole time, like, okay, how are they gonna do the time skip thing if, like, you know, the Empire is gonna take over, but, you know, we win the... Sylvain! Holy crap! What? Oh. Sylvain can wait. Uh, yes, I want to speak to Lysip. Can we talk about this elephant? Jesus Christ, girl! Wait, is she... So she's 20 now. Huh. She sure doesn't look it, but... Thank you for helping me with my training again today, Professor. No worries. I got, you know, we just picking it up like nothing happened. Don't sweat it. I'm gonna keep at it for a while longer. So you go on ahead. Hmm. No. You did three entire push-ups. You can't overexert yourself, Lysithia. Rest. <laughs> I can't. Not when I'm right on the cusp of using my power to greater potential. Surely you yourself are tired. Just don't worry about me, okay? This is the most real situation I've been in. Two people are exhausted. You should rest. I'm not that tired. No, Lysithia. You're the tired one. I don't need written that. This is getting too real. Oh my god, what? No! What the crud? I'm sorry, Professor. It was careless of me to continue, despite how fatigued I clearly was. God dang. I probably should have listened to you. Ugh. Now I've made a mess of things. Jesus Christ, please stay safe. You. <laughs> She's like a. <laughs> no. I can't what? help but feel the need to rush in all things constantly. You get that way when you realize you haven't got much time. Because of the war? What are you talking about? What the crap? 13 years ago. House Ordelia was involved in a civil conflict within the Empire. All we did was respond to a call for aid. We weren't involved politically, but once the rebellion was crushed, my family was held responsible for the aid we gave, and the Empire gained some sway over us as a result. What the crud? Is this about her crests? You... At the time, the noble houses of the Alliance took a passive stance. No one lent aid to my family. As a result, some key officials within the family were killed, and people from the Empire were sent to replace them. No. Among those people were some mysterious mages. They were unsettling in a word, skin pale as death. It's those who slither in the dark. They even had influence on Lysithia too. One after another, they captured and imprisoned the children of our household. They began performing terrible rituals on the children. Though it's probably more accurate to call them experiments. It's just like Edelgard. You gotta be kidding me. With the Empire what? monitoring our every move, my parents could do nothing but watch in horror as all of this unfolded. One after another, the children died. Till the only one left was me. You know, my hair wasn't always this color. During their experiments, they'd been doing things with my blood. One morning, I awoke like this. A shock of white hair, all trace of pigment, gone. Upon seeing me, the mages were delighted. They realized that their experiments had finally succeeded. Sure enough, they ran a test and saw that two crests coexisted within me. Losing pigment from my hair wasn't the only loss. The mages informed me that my lifespan was now greatly shortened. No. Ugh. I thought this whole time she was, you know, just in a rush because she felt like she was so behind, like, you know, so far behind the other students. But no, she's actually going to die soon. Holy crap. Five more years what? at most. Perhaps less. God dang. No. What? <sighs> no, I'm 
mad. What the crud? Screw. Was the mage Solon? Or was it just other people? Oh my god, I'm so angry. Shortly mm. thereafter, the mages lost interest in me. And we never saw them in the Ordelia household again. Since all that, our family has been in decline. It's challenging now even to govern our territory. After all my mother and father have suffered, I at least want them to have peace as they grow older. That is all I wish for. But I haven't much time to ensure it comes to pass. I don't even... Can what we're doing right now and Lysithia's wishes even, like, coexist? I... I don't know, dude. What the crud? This is so sad. What? It's the crest! God dang it! Why?! God, I hate Rhea. I mean, it's not Rhea's fault that, you know, humans abuse the Crest system and put so much importance on them, but still, why do they exist at all? I don't think it's natural. But, come on, Lysithia, you can't give up. Please, no. It's not like what's been done to me can be undone. We don't know that, though. Come on. Yeah, there's got to be a way to undo it, maybe. Professor, the only way I can conceive of would be to remove my Crest somehow. I don't know if that's even remotely possible. Even if it were, I wouldn't be of much use to you and the others without my crest. Well, Scythia, that doesn't freaking matter. God dang, I'm gonna ask Rhea myself. Ah! I'm... We'll find a way, no matter what, Lysithia, I swear it. You sound resolved. I'll allow your resolve to bolster my own. Heck yeah. Thank you, Professor. You got it, god dang. Dog, screw Chris, real t Oh my god, A support already. You know what, I want to support with her more. God. How can one, how can one support just change my, oh my god, look at, look at Raphael, dude. <laughs> look at his hair. Oh my god, bro, how can one support make me, my opinion of Lysithia has changed almost 100%. That was... Gosh, she's such a trooper. And I also... Dang, Mercedes, she got she got her, you know, priestess outfit on. Right on, girl. But I get where she's coming from on multiple levels that, like... I don't want to get into it right now. God dang. Also, hey, Sylvain. What's up, bro? I'm sorry. I got a little sidetracked. <laughs> what the crap? You up? You haven't even aged a day. Look at him. I swear, is he wearing the same exact outfit? I no, it's a little it's a little bit different, but hey brother. Hey professor. It's been a really long time, hasn't it? Yeah. I think my cape's still wet. Uh the last five years have been full of heartbreak. Not from girls, <laughs> but friends and family becoming enemies. Yeah. God, Sylvain's probably got it rough too. He's you know, eventually we're gonna have to fight. You know, Dimitri. And all of Fargus, that's where his family and his house is. One of the things that kept me going was the hope you'd return. And now here you are. A lot has changed, but you're back. And it's the first time I can remember being happy in a while. Oh, come on. Don't say stuff like that. Jesus. Wait, what the? Advanced drill. Huh? What does this do? Uh, that is interesting. I, crap. I wonder what the monastery is like now. God, I'm just still taking this all in, guys. Oh, there's even, like... Actually, I think that was there before, but, man, the monastery looks, like, way different now. Wait, hold up. Now that Rhea's not here, maybe there's something in her, like, quarters that could help us. Maybe. Well, I guess Edelgard probably have found it by now. Nope, nothing from the looks of it. Oh, yeah, there she is. Hey. Professor, I'm sorry to have dragged you into the fight again so soon after our reunion. Well, I am a mercenary, it's whatever. But you appeared at a most opportune time. I'm truly humbled by your support, my teacher. Thank you. And so I will. I'm hoping your abilities from five years prior are still intact. <laughs> Crud, I hope so too. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you're ready to head out, okay? Okay. I guess our mission this month is to, wait, what's her, what's her, what the, okay, so, yeah, she can teach us access, too. So, it seems like this is just how you catch, okay, my understanding might not be perfect, but 
I guess this is how you catch Byleth up, because he's kind of behind. Also, Hubert is now completely taken over the role of Sedith. I find that hilarious and also very appropriate. Allow me to brief you on the details of our situation. What up, man? The Empire firmly controls the western portion of Fargus. However, the central and eastern regions continue to put up heavy resistance. The strongholds in these regions are Aryan Road, the fortress city, and Ferdiad, the kingdom capital. We cannot control Fargus until we have taken both of these cities. So, the, gosh, I guess there is no way around it. God, I don't want to fight Claude, man. What? Dang it! As for the Alliance, Houses Gloucester and Ordelia seem predisposed to capitulate to us. However, due to interference from Houses Regan and Goneril, we have yet to secure their cooperation. So that's why we're going to the Alliance first. Crud. Claude obviously hopes to keep the Alliance whole through diplomacy, but because we have had to focus our efforts against the Church until now, our forces have yet to meet his. We have only recently begun to take the fight to Alliance territory. <sighs> I'm already struggling, Jesus, what the crud. Man, this is scary, bro. Also, yeah, I'll get you some fish, shut up. I'll, I'll figure it out. Can't be, I can't be mean to Hubert anymore. He's our, like, second in command. Wait, are we second in command to Edelgard? God, God, she's so tiny. Look at her outfit, though. Holy crud. They really went all out. Killing a girl. Crud. I kind of wish Byleth... Well, I guess Byleth kind of did get a redesign. So does that mean we also aged up five years? Or, do, or is it like, oh, Sothis what? had us, you know... And her like time bubble. So who knows? Dad's old room. Mm. God dang it. Say, so, hey, bruh. Still lazy and crap. I feel like you would have outgrown that considering the dire circumstances. Professor, do you know how happy I was to hear you were still alive? Mm, I have a rough idea, but you could tell me again. I'll tell you how happy. <laughs> For the past two days, I haven't had my morning or my afternoon naps. <laughs> dang, that is big. You're, you're taking those naps every day? How did you get anything done? Well, as long as we weren't marching. Can't sleep much then. <sighs> but it's not for want of trying. <laughs> Would you... <laughs> what? By the way, with Professor Hanneman not around... Oh, yeah, I guess you guys were buddies. I've occupied his room. What? So I am well-equipped to perform research on you. Isn't that exciting? Woohoo. Can't wait to be your guinea pig. Oh, I wouldn't get that up. Hmm. Well, Linhart's taking it surprisingly well. Wait, who the crud is that? Is that just like a random person? I don't know. Man, the school feels so empty now, though. I guess we did lose a lot of the... Yeah, it's just some random dude. He lost a lot of, you know, the student population. Not literally, but, you know, doing their own thing now. Encyclopedia of Plants! Isn't it exciting? No, I don't, I don't really care. Hello. It's normal for history to be revised in favor of those who hold the power. The documents in this library are no exception. It's perfectly possible for someone to have made edits to them, but it's my belief that no one has the power to blot out the truth entirely. I like to read the same texts over and over again. That way, I can spot some of the truths hidden between the lines. That is an interesting uh, opinion to hold. I feel like that's in the game for a specific... I might be gleaning too much from the actual narrative, but... I don't know. This game is incredibly interesting from, you know, a fellow history buff. I'm not the best at reciting history, I will admit. What the crud is this? Have we ever been able to go up here? Archbishop's room. Am I the Archbishop now? Or, like, what's going on with that? I guess... You know, I got the green hair. Kind of fits. No, we've never been able to... What the heck? Is this where Rhea was that time she was singing? I guess it is. Oh, that blew up. That sucks. Huh. This is really cool. I'm gonna... I mean, there's probably gonna be other changes. To... Hey, Man Manuela's back! Yay! Crud! I can't believe... I'm saying that, shoot! <laughs> I'm just... I guess I'm happy is all. Crud. I don't want more people to die, but I'm gonna make it a point. I don't know how many kill all enemy maps they're gonna throw at us, but I intend to spare everyone I can, you know? After the battle five years ago, 
the Imperial Army occupied Garrig Mach. The cathedral and several other buildings were destroyed, but we've done some repair work here and there, and we're using the buildings as a base of operations. As for me, well, the church moved its headquarters to Fargus, and I've seen no reason to follow. Mm, uh, I, I, I guess I can understand her motivation. When I returned to Enbar, I received a summons from Her Majesty, and I chose to answer. Okay. Well, wh wh where exactly is Enbar? I'm not sure. I'm also not going to do this till I actually go see if the statues are intact. Right. Holy crap. Hmm. What are you looking at? Screw you. <laughs> Taking everything so personally. I'm just a little on it. Oh, hey. Yo, he's back. Need something. Yeah, bro. Cook me up. Cut. Oh, dump. I'm too late. Well, frig. Been... Where should we go now? Crud. Well, I guess there's no one in the dorms. I don't know how to proceed with the advanced drill. <gasps> okay, they did live. Crud. Randolph. He's alive. And uh, I forgot the other one's name. I think it started Ladislava. Yeah. Where the crud are they? Oh, hey. they're right here. Oh, wait. Uh, Huh? That's not Lottie Slava. What the crud? Ah, a new face. I am Randolph von Burglies. Wow, he looks... Does he look older, or am I just stupid? I'm the guardian of this place. Wait a moment. <laughs> I'm sure I've seen you somewhere before. Yeah, what up? It's me. I'm back. My hair somehow didn't grow or anything, but yeah, you know. So I was here five years ago, so I'm actually your senior. <laughs> ah, yes. You're Her Majesty's professor. You're alive? What up? Um, oh, this is my little sister, Flesh. She's just a rookie, but she's helping me as my assistant. Uh, hello, I'm Flesh von Burglies. It's nice to meet you. Her voice is so similar, crud. I know who you are, but I also don't. I'm pretty sure it's Marie. I don't know, from Persona. There, I said it. Uh, anyway. I know I'm inexperienced, but I'm gonna do my best. You can count on me to look after my big brother. I've heard you're planning to march into Alliance territory. I'll be here to guard the fort. Okay, Wandoff. Don't get crazy with power, though. Like it'll go. Okay, it'll guard isn't one hundred percent crazy with power, but I'm just saying. Hi. I fear that is a piece of what's going on here. I'm not so lovey. Do oh, my widow Emperor would do nothing bad. I'm not that dumb. It's very clear that this game is. Ambiguous with how it's that's being Hello there. shut up. I want, I want your cabbages free sample free sample free sample free sample. I'm out here Yeah <laughs> Cuz like the dude even said, you know, like if we win the war We're suddenly the good guys if Rhea fends off the evil rebellion She she is in the position of power and who's to say with nemesis, right? She directly told us that that was an evil, evil man that waged war against her ancestor. Uh, wasn't it Seros? Pretty sure. The opening cutscene, right? Who's to say he wasn't in the right the whole time? We don't know because freaking Rhea be lying. And we've caught her lying multiple times. Also, why the? Why is there a line? What the dump? Th that's new. Frig. All right. Well, <laughs> can I cut? I'm a professor. Can I cut? Can I oh, screw you guys? I also kind of want to bring up. I know I'm just like literally circling around the uh, <laughs> monastery. I couldn't find the gazebo. Um. Wait, crap. No, I didn't want to do that. Uh, the line when we were in the tomb, right? Where she says, "You're another failed experiment." Bro, what the frick? Okay. What the crap does that mean? We are a failed experiment. Does that mean she... The reason we don't have a heartbeat... Oh my god, a platinum fish. Holy crow, is because... She was experimenting on humans. That's what I think. So far, anyways. And that's... At least partially why we have green hair. Oh my god, it's terrible! My shoes and hair don't match! I need a favor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll help you out. I guess. I don't, I, just, I don't know when we'll have time to do those uh, quests right, but I'll try. I also want to see who the crud this support is. I want to knock out the ones with the professor first, and then the shipping will resume. It always does. Professor. Hey, brother! God dang, he really did get tall. God, I'm happy for him, but yeah, Caswar. How the, how the ye has been treating you. Hey, professor, something's been bothering me. 
Remember that suspicious guy I chased after back when I was a student? Yes, I actually do. A knight scolded me for it, but at the time, I really thought I was doing the right thing. Now that I've had more experience on the battlefield, though... I've been looking for you. There isn't much time, so I'll keep this brief. What up? The knights encountered a band of brigands while out marching. It was hard fought, but we prevailed. Our soldiers are highly trained, but the enemy was formidable, and we weren't expecting combat. There were a number of casualties among our troops. Uh... I mean, that is really sad, but yeah, why, why is he reporting this? I don't... I... There is something I wanted to bring to your attention. The brigands all bore identical tattoos of a scorpion on their arms. A scorp? What? Please, keep an eye out for that mark in the future. Oh no. What the crud? Caspar, what... I feel like Caspar knows... Ugh. Don't mention it. If you'll excuse me, I need to get back to my duties. Later. Yes. What the crud's that? <laughs> Heck of a coincidence, right? <laughs> it's like we're in a video game, and then, you know... It's... <laughs> okay. Yeah. Was the guy that apprehended Caspar actually the villain? What? As soon as I mention that suspicious guy, this happens. Yeah. But, uh, it's good to hear they finally even dealt with, though, right? I guess. But some of the knights died in combat. They died because of what I did five years ago. This is my fault. So the... So the person back then, going to that playground or whatever, actually wasn't... Those who slither? It was just another faction altogether. Okay. If I'd stayed quiet and tracked the guy down like you said, we would have stopped those brigands sooner. And I wouldn't have blood on my hands. <laughs> Alright, the way this is handled is kind of silly, but yes, I get... I get what they're trying to do, establish that domino effects can occur, but like... Caspar, a million different scenarios could have happened and those soldiers could have still died, or vice versa. You can't change... Okay, you specifically can't change the past, okay? Come on. It's no use trying to comfort me. <laughs> you know I'm right. Just say it. Now you put words in my mouth now. I, I taught you better. Those poor knights. It's all my fault. What? I picked... I picked wrong? No! Maybe I did. Crap! Now I'm concerned. Okay. Who the heck is this jabroni? Hello there. Anyway. <laughs> I'm so mean to the other staff. <laughs> God. <laughs> I'm the worst. Actually, no, those who slither are probably wait. I can't decide, frankly. The last five years have been difficult at times. My relationship with Edelgard is rather contentious. I know. Due to the incident with my father. Yeah. Nevertheless, I cannot abandon my family's duties. As Duke Iyer, I must play my part in the Imperial Army. Edelgard intends to abolish the nobility, but I know I can dissuade her from doing so. Mm, I... Let's, you know, think of alternatives. I mean, I'm honestly pro no nobility. I don't think a caste system works. Just throwing that out there. It causes way more problems than it... Professor. Hey. Oh, God. I really want to do this. But no, I, I don't think we should do this yet. I, wa I want to talk to other students. And also, we still have not done an actual drill. Cr Where the dump is Raphael? <gasps> speak of the devil! Or should I say speak of the hungry? Hello. I got myself in a perfect shape. Not a lot changed, are you sure? Hey, Professor. What have you been up to for five years? Hope you haven't gone soft. I got myself into perfect shape. Took all five years of pushing my muscles to the limit. But look! You, you just put, like, dinner plates on your shoulders. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, he's looking strong. I, I feel like you'd be so mad. <laughs> Screw it, I'll pick this. What? <laughs> Can't you see my muscles? Do I gotta undress so you can get a better look? Oh, God. Uh, now that you mention it, uh, anyways... <laughs> Technically, yes. Ah, screw it. I need to start doing these advanced drills, because what else are we going to do with our time? Dunno. This experience is critical. Huh. Does it, is it just me, or does he sound different? What the Oh, Shamir. 
You didn't abandon us. What's that look on your face? <laughs> Surprised to see me? Is it okay if I say yes? I'm a mercenary. Always have been. Even when I was with the Knights of Seros. I never was too attached to Fodlan. I was considering leaving soon. But I might change my mind if you're around. Okay. I guess she... Gosh, a lot of what happens here... Oh, Bernie. Does kind of hinge just on the professor. And because he is a silent protagonist in gameplay, it's just so hard to believe. You know that guy that never uh, said much, but always occasionally handed us gifts? I'll stake my life for him. It's just kind of funny. I don't know. I'm not reading into things. But look at, look at this outfit. Look at it. Look at the boots. Look at the... She's got the shoulder pads and everything. God, how how do they how are they so good at designing armor? God. Are we leaving for battle? Yeah. I heard it's a long march. Eh, not that long. But it's fine. I've had plenty of time <laughs> to stay inside lately, so I think it's time I run out. Yeah, I can do this. No more Bernie Bear. <laughs> Bernie Bear? Uh. When did this start? Oh, yeah. People call me Bernie Bear since I hole up in my den all the time. <laughs> Not anymore, though. Yeah, looks like you got some sun. Kinda, I guess. What can she do for? All right, so interesting. They couldn't, they couldn't do this stuff for us before. So now that I guess the teachers are well, Manuela's still here. Our students kind of take up that spot. I like that. Is there anyone we haven't talked to? Oh my God, Mercedes and. How did I how did I miss Lysithia inside the dining hall? The dump? I think I saw uh, uh no, she's right here. Hello, Mercedes. Her outfit, you know what? Her hair changed. Whoa, like really? I guess it's all stuffed underneath her uh I don't think do rag is the right word. Oh my god, Lysithia. Uh but like ha habit? Is that what it's called? I don't know. My Catholicism studies are not the best. I have good friends in both the Alliance and Fargus, so this fighting weighs heavily on me. Oh yeah, I guess that is true. Sorry, I was just, just so distracted by your hair thing. Uh, I can't bear the thought uh, of battling the Knights of Saros to the death. But we kind of have to. I have to keep my chin up though, right? Let's press on together, Professor. God dang. Some of the... <sighs> God, I kind of wish I didn't. No, because if I recruit, if I didn't recruit the people I did, then they would be fighting the Empire and they'd be going against me. <laughs> I am, I am 100% happy though. I got Lysithia to back me up. I'm relieved you're here, Professor. It seems we've reached a stalemate on the war front. I admit I'm feeling apprehensive about fighting the Alliance. Yeah, that makes sense. You have to cast aside your doubts. Well. You don't have to do anything if you don't want to. There's still time to back out. No. I have to shelve my personal feelings. There are bigger things at play here. God, she's, she's not wrong, dude. Lysithia, she gets it, man. Holy crud. I'll fight with full force. I'm counting on you to lead us to victory, Professor. I got you. Let's see. Can we... Eh, we can, well... Huh, now I think... Wait, Byleth has this too? When did that happen? Maybe it would be smart to start learning faith. That's a little... Isn't it kind of too late in the game, though, for that? And we already have, like, what? Four people that can heal? Nah. I think it's maybe just best to uh, try and prioritize. What do we need the most right now? Probably axes. I think that's it. And if we talk to everybody... We haven't talked to Caspar or Petra. So I'll go pay them a visit. Oh, or Dorothea. Wait, I wonder if those plants I put in the, <laughs> the greenhouse are, have they grown? Tell me, greenhouse keeper. How are the how are the plants? Well, they grow so big we can't even fit them in the, in the house anymore. I'm sorry. So we got a white Verona. What does that do? And some lilies. Nice. It's gonna be a while until we get a B rank in uh that though. That's fine. Would though did they get sent to the convoy? Uh, yeah, it did. Permanently increases resistance by one. A rare variety of Verona. Okay. Wait, I think there was other items that we had there too. So, the greenhouse gives you these types? No, that we got that, the Fruit of Life, from uh, one of the characters. I think it was Mercedes joining us. I keep that in mind if I decide to do another playthrough. Eh, 
and Dorothea's outfit's interesting, I guess. It fits the whole, like, diva aspect. I like her earrings, though. They make her look a little more grown up, you know? Good to see you. What up? These days, so many old friends seem to be disappearing. But you, you're here. It's incredible to see you again after five years. I have a feeling your name will go down in history. Hopefully for good reasons. I'm <laughs> just throwing that out there. I don't know. Gosh, there's so much uncertainty. I hope... I hope they don't make us fight Edelgard, though. That would be... Heartbreaking, to say the least. Speaking of heartbreakers, holy crap. Like, is this like the... I guess this is how they have, like, the soldiers in Bridget. Or at least, you know, the high-ranking offer. That is so cool! God, they did a really great job with Petra as a character. I need to start doing more of her supports. Edelgard is controlling the Empire. She is putting the pressure on the Kingdom and Alliance. Empire and religion are at open war. It will be... difficult for us at first. But corrupt nobles are many. That means the common people will rebel and be joining our side. Yeah, that's a good point, too. With you, Professor, the battle tides will... Uh, will turn. I have certainty. Heck yeah. I'll try my best, girl. Yeah, let's get these up. That is... Oh, snap. We, we, learn, we can rank our swords up super fast with Petra. Crud, can you do these multiple times? Oh my Edelgard god, that was so many points. Let me try again. I'm super... Ah, uh, only once per week. That's okay, though. Man, so uh, I don't want to enter that. I don't really see a point. We can we have not really tons of money, but I imagine as we continue onward, there's going to be other battalions. And honestly, I think that's the better option. But um, I do want to uh, okay. So we need a rank with Caspar for axes. I imagine we'll also need that for Sylvain, so he can become a Wavering Lord. So yeah, axes are like our most important thing. So. And also Edelgard. So if we get that going, our pretty much our whole army is gonna be functioning better. All right, I'm ready to fight. Let's do this. <laughs> so eager, dude. Gosh, real talk. His voice actor, the perfect casting for Caspar. 100%. I'm. S <laughs> but bro, well, no, no, I'm counting on you. Now is the time to get pumped up. Let's let's not get ahead of ourselves. Leave it to me. I can take on the whole uh, <laughs> most of the enemy's <laughs> army. <laughs> Thank you for being realistic. I'll take the other half. I know my limits now, Professor. Heck yeah. Character growth, my man. Love that for him. All right, oh, let's, uh, oh crap, my bad. Do we have any gifts to give? No, I think everyone's, how, ah oh, crud. I also gotta keep that in consideration because if we do have chances to tutor our students, we gotta keep their motivation uh, in check. <laughs> Would you like some Woes' kiss, ba? All right, well, um, I would do some extra supports, but I have the feeling that this episode is sort of long. So instead, we're just going to do our, um, I guess our drills and prep for the next battle. From the way things are looking, I, I really can't get that much tutoring from uh, characters specializing in physical weapons. Because the way I kind of made our house is we're evenly distributed. Okay, not exactly. I think we have a higher bias for magic, but... uh kind of split down the middle, so I think it would be wise to at least learn some uh, miracle magic, and uh, who better to do from Wichita? Just throwing that out there, she's pretty darn good. You know, so hey, now we got that. There is still more to learn. <laughs> yeah, I guess, but uh, that pretty much ends this session. Crud, I guess time to move on to the next battle, which is right now, actually. God dang. This is, man, so much has happened so fast, gosh, but, uh, yeah, we're gonna end things off here in the next episode, it's mission time, the great bridge to, uh, enter the Ardrestian, or not the Ardrestian, but the Alliance territory, it's coming up, crud, dude, things are finally getting, well, <laughs> they've been getting serious for a good chunk of the game, but god, this is wild, yo. But, uh, I guess we're gonna... Holy crud. Our students can turn into a lot of stuff. What's going on? They, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Lysithia has new outfits. Oh, my God. Oh, I gotta take I gotta take a second to see this. So, she can promote to a warlock. 
Nice. Okay. Uh, we're going to handle this next time. I'm really excited to see what uh, potential things our students can now turn into. <gasps> Ferdinand is level higher than Edelgard? What the dump? He was not kidding around. He's really trying to be better than her. Shoot. But uh, yeah, we'll take care of that next time, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. I'm having so much fun with this game. I, I can't stop playing it. So expect more episodes real soon. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.